in your closet may contribute to pollution in the ocean. More than 80% of marine pollution comes from human activities on land. Scientists have found that fibers, like those in synthetic clothing, are contaminating aquatic life. Ben Tracy shows us how one company is working to fix that problem. They're in everything from yoga pants to running shorts to that soft, fuzzy fleece. Tiny shreds of plastic that shed in the wash and can be eaten by the same marine life we eat. Unlike dryers, most washing machines don't have filters that trap lint. So when you throw synthetic garments in the wash, material breaks off and can slip past sewage treatment plants and into waterways. The so-called microfibers have turned up in waters across the globe, including Lake Michigan and along the shores of the Gulf of Mexico. When we see reports showing microfiber in, in the ocean, in, in fish, in plankton, you know, we're alarmed by its impact. And Doug Freeman is chief operating that. officer of Patagonia, which is trying to find a solution. The company, known for its outdoor apparel, such as fleece jackets, funded a study on microfibers last year by the University of California, Santa Barbara. Researchers there found that a single synthetic fleece jacket released as much as 250,000 microfibers when washed in a machine. Newer, higher quality garments shed less than older ones. Even a wastewater treatment plant that's filtering up to 95%, there's still a really high number that are getting through. Project researcher Bess Ruff says underwater creatures can ingest the material. For fish, a lot of times the microfibers are found in their intestines, and most of the times we're not eating that part. So direct ingestion with fish isn't as much of a concern, but with shellfish, they're actually getting embedded in the tissue, and that's the part that we eat. If you're aware this is a significant problem and that you're contributing to it, why not just stop selling these items? Because in many cases, these items have longer um, useful life than their biodegradable counterparts. Ultimately, we come down to choices. You know, do we want something that has that microfiber impact or do we want something that's more throwaway? Patagonia has not yet changed how it designs its fleece but the company is working to find new fabrics that shed less. It also wants its customers to buy only the clothes they actually need and wash them less. We encourage customers to, to wash it just as few times as they possibly can. You don't need to wash it with every use. Spot cleaning is really important. For CBS This Morning, Ben Tracy, Los Angeles. Bravo to Doug Freeman and Patagonia for even noticing yeah, and wanting to do stock something about of it. it. I, I guess I'm never going to wash my fleece again. Yeah, yeah. I'll keep wearing it. I'll just never wash With it. With the lint brush. <laughs>